means death. And Hebrew. So where'd you guys come from anyway? Someone knows you, invited you over, or from CC, or... Yeah, yeah, where are you guys from? Because I was here for like the last three days and none of you were ever on. They only you know how... You know how I discovered you, Mask? Your brother, or maybe that was Bishop Tron. I can't fucking remember. No, I asked, um... Okay, I asked someone for a beta key, but then someone referred me to you. That's that's how it happened. I was pleasantly Our, surprised. Uh, for me, Chewy, Nailroom, and Caminate, we're from SC2GG, and our server exploded. Our event server exploded, and then we went to Mumble. Mumble is gay, and uh, and then I I had seen campaign creations before and talked with some people from there, and then we decided to come here because nobody was using it. Yeah. Well. Who do you know from CC? The vent and explode. Just uh, who controls? Um, who controls campaign creations, anyways? Lavish you. Mexicans. Lavish <laughs> you. Uh, I don't know anybody from campaign creations. I know campaign creations from many years, from when I first played E Dust, and then I saw somebody playing my map on a YouTube uh, account. And then I asked him, well, where do you guys play? And he said, Campaign Creations. And then I found the server. Which map? Asteroid Field. Is that... Um, yeah. I think it's the one you hated. It probably wasn't me that you asked that. It was probably Ricky, wasn't it? I don't remember. Because the only people that are uploading videos that I know of is me and Ricky. So, it was probably Ricky you asked. So, yeah. I would upload videos if I already got the full version of um, Fraps. Well, that's easy to Just arrange. download Fats. it. I, I do not. Um, you're suggesting torrent, right? He's a. I'm not suggesting no, anything. <clears throat> we're suggesting borrowing it from the internet, <laughs> definitely. <laughs> from the I'm not yeah. suggesting anything on the record. I don't support torrents. It's been Jerry uploaded by. Been by uh, the video, the asteroid field one, has been uploaded by Hone Jazi. Yeah, yep, that's Ricky. Ricky. There's yeah. nothing wrong with Torrent. <laughs> yeah, Ricky. You, you say that, but I have different thoughts about it. No, there isn't he anything hasn't wrong with Torrent. Yeah. It's what Ricky you Torrent is. It's what you Torrent with that man. It's Torrent itself. Think of yourself as Robin Hood. <laughs> <laughs> no, well, I mean, it's like that's it's, such uh, a cop the, out. There's that like three me MMOs and free, uh. Like a bunch of uh, games that now, when you to download them, you can download them via torrent or direct download. So I you're torrenting the game, so it's like torrenting it. I, uh, I torrented Portal 2 and played it, and it's a pirating. Um, now if that. perhaps, that, if perhaps that you got the full version of a game, but you only got it for like I don't know, a couple of weeks, a few weeks, whatever, and you liked it, and then just. I don't know, something temporary, then I guess people, uh, that'd be a, a better system, but, yeah. See, the thing is, is that people charge way too fucking much for garbage. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You tell it like it is, girl. I mean, we've got to that the price range of games of being like 60 and 60 plus for games where, like, oh, yeah. campaigns and single players only for like six hours and stuff, it's complete garbage. But it's not just that. T like, THQ wants to charge like ten, uh, eight bucks for j just a skin for um, uh, the Space Marines in Dawn of War 2. Look at wow. DLCs, exact DLCs right now. The company saw they uh, first did a test DLC to see if they could make money of it, and now that companies know that if you can actually make DLCs, people will pay for them. So yeah. that's why there's like map packs and stuff that you buy and people pay for. Well, I don't mind that because they make something that you want and it, uh, as, as supply and demand goes, or just demand in general, uh, they have the right to charge you something. I just, the rate of which things are increasing in price and then the quality of things just decreasing in general, it's, they're, f uh, they're forcing a lowering, uh, they're forcing us to lower our standards basically. You think games are this bad? This program I'm using. Games are bad. Go into the graphics market, bro. 
where Adobe releases an entire new CS suit, and all they do is just change the interface so it's black, and it costs you thousands and thousands of dollars. Yeah, Adobe is pretty bad. No, yeah, I agree. Actually, I was gonna mention. Uh, GIMP is very good because it's, it's not as good as like Photoshop, but I mean, for free, it's just. Oh, yeah, I mean, I'm not playing people right. use GIMP, but I mean, it's like it's saying, is that games are bad, but the actual software market in general is just ridiculous. I use a software for work that costs 100 hundred dollars. I, I blame Activision you for starting the trend of charging 60 bucks for games. PC. I used SolidWorks for this semester at school, and it would have been sixteen hundred, seventeen hundred dollars. Oh, who asked about Warlords and Merchant? I'm Merchant. Me. I'm Merchant, and I have, uh, I have an, uh, what you call it, a hybrid on top of my command center, and I have something called a current plan zone. Yeah. Uh, no, you're a warlord. Oh, yes, yes. So what yeah. do I do? Okay, as a warlord, you um, build units and you know you do the whole general melee thing. You expand and kill things, um, but you get a, a, a warlord's defender to defend against rushes. Um, what you do is, with how you interact with merchants is that you can uh, you can browse through the merchant stores like uh, Quantum Menace, Chewbacca, whatever, um, and you can select uh, either to show units or researchers, and you can purchase from them, and after an amount of time, they, uh, the units will appear in your land zone, uh, researches are instant. As a merchant, you build stuff, and you, uh, you make buildings that um, allow you to make uh, units, and you, um, you advertise them, do whatever you want, and people buy from them, and the more you, money you make, uh, the more profit you make, I mean, uh, the higher your profit, profit score goes up. Um, you can set the price uh, for what you can set the price and a percentage for how much things cost. Like if that something is 130 percent, or you can even drop it to zero percent if you want to uh, dick around. To <laughs> hit dick. I don't know <laughs> what skill level you guys are, but this map is very very macro intensive. So if you don't have like very strong macro, oh yeah, oh yeah, you, you you're gonna probably get rolled. Blind, uh, well, uh, especially. With being first time, I'm still kind of. So most of the units are the same. Yeah, I'm at a five, but uh, you'll see uh, what are the difference if you read their description. Oh yeah, there, there's a huge range of units and abilities. Uh, there's upgrades. For, uh, there's dozens of upgrades for dozens of units, and there's elite units and uh, heroic or and legendary units and. Well, whatever they're called, but they range in uh, in power and stuff. But yeah, this black cap is 300, and I recommend to expand as fast as goddamn possible. Immediately. Okay, so I'll wait till I have 200 supply, and then I'll get my second command center. <laughs> That's at least 50 supplies sooner than I usually do. There's units like Hellions that shoot air and Hellions that shoot while moving, just to give you an example of what crazy shit's in this game. There's Bandlings that explode. Scourges that, can, that have charge are invisible <laughs> and splash. Bandlings that can explode? That must have taken a lot you of money. enough minerals. Giant. Oh, no more splash? You yeah. have not enough minerals. No, they don't splash anymore. Thank God. Right. And then you have units like the Zeus that will just make you very, very angry. They get stuck somewhere. Because they're very big. And then you have Overlords that you just buy thousands of. Gay Lords. Yes. Oh yeah, uh, Queen's um, instant uh, spawn mark. No, uh, autocast, you mean. Yes, yeah, autocast. My brain is working at half power right now. Half. That much? That much? I guess it must be the penis cutting off of the blood circulation. <laughs> what about a penis? I couldn't help but 
over here something about a penis while listening to the should modify it so the shadow ops make you can make more than one nuke at that would be interesting or make an upgrade so that nukes can, uh, when you launch a nuke it fires five nukes in a perimeter oh, yeah. research complete it's basically you could you can pretty much suggest uh, whatever you want, and uh, sometimes it happens. I still want my enormous fucking uh, scourge that flies as slow as a mothership, but when it explodes, it's just you don't want to be near it. Successful troll is successful. No doubt. Aspect. Silly rabbit. Ricky, I hope you're a little learn. Gas is important. That's the last uh, that's the advice I could give. Unless you're putting a hundred K gas, you're not safe. So like if someone asks for a unit, how do you actually give the person a unit? They have to buy it. Yeah. yeah. Oh, uh, did you receive a notification, Wasman? No, what's up? Oh, you're Wasman. Who is the guy who asked how do you give them a unit? Me. No. No, okay, that's what I was wondering. Basically, if you're a merchant, I haven't actually played a merchant, I always played Warlord. Uh, but you can buy stuff and then it shows up on the menu for the Warlords. Basically, it's your job to have something that will be in demand. Uh, for example, Scourge almost always in demand. Uh, Diamondbacks are decent, Thors are decent, stuff, stuff like that, stuff that, stuff that the people will buy. And then they will buy it through the top right menu on their screen, and then you will get money for it depending on how expensive it is, and change the pricing for it and such. And then upgrade your tech and uh, move on from there. Or did have How do you change the pricing of it? Like I'm making like a dragon right now, so how would I be like, oh yeah, I want to charge it. Million dollars I actually you know. Really billion. Nuclear launch exactly detected. Interface Fucking lag, man. Yeah. It's all the government's fault. I blame Chewy. Hey, look, it's Jubot. Can't afford a decent plan. Or won't pay for yeah, I'm actually thinking of buying a new video called Hobbs. I don't know. First buy Portal 2, then we'll talk. Well... I want to buy a second graphics card. I want to buy ice cream and a pony. Mmm, ponies. <laughs> I like the sound of that, sir. Yeehaw. Yuck, yuck. Worker chase is under attack. Also, there will be, you, you want to find out which merchant is doing upgrades, and but you keep an eye on them to grab the mining and gas upgrades Chewy. in particular. Dino Chewbacca! Base is under attack. <laughs> God. Why did you leave, Fatty? A planet killed Chewbacca. Base is under attack. Kaladora. Razor sponsors liquid. Boys like me. And I'm proud to be an American. For this kind of map, yeah, it would be laggy because you have like a bunch of people completely spread out. Not even counting the triggers. 
If you have a shitty CPU, that map will murder you. Upgrade complete. Surrender. Upgrade complete. Does it?